Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Anton and hopefully all of you guys are having a fantastic day because yes, it is our rock and metal day and we're going to be returning to Star Set. Yeah, you guys love Star Set and we're going to be doing Carnivore today. So obviously Ricochet blew me away. Ricochet is my favorite Star Set song so far. I know, I'm sorry, but that song is a fucking masterpiece. Uh, and the video just... Man, all of their videos are dope. Like, honestly, all the videos are fantastic. But Ricochet just... Yeah, dude, had that heart, man. That, like, crazy black mirror mixed with crazy levels of emotion, man. I loved it. But before we get... But, uh, yeah, without further ado, sit back, relax. Let's enjoy Star Set Carnivore. Let's do it, people. I love... Oh, ooh. Man, they got, like, cool stories going on. They always have stuff going on, eh? Like, 2035 militarized feature... Wait, what? Militarized featuring Washington, D.C. Is this going to happen after all the coronavirus stuff? When we're in martial law? I'm just kidding, but maybe. Uh, it just feels sketchy. But, um... And these guys have dope music videos. And I actually paused it. Um, I love their use of cellos. I, I really love their use of cellos. And just how they blend electronics and cellos. I'm, I'm saying cellos like it's like a big part of their, their music. Even though I've only heard three songs. But I think all of them have had cellos and violins and stuff. But yeah, they're a very, very cool band. But let's get back into it. Okay, one thing, um, I don't even know the singer's name. I know, it's terrible. But um, he has, like, the first time I heard uh, Trials, I wasn't, I thought his vocal delivery was, um, like, decent. Like, I thought he was, like, a, a pretty good front man. And then I heard Monster, and then I was like, okay, he's a good singer. But it wasn't until I heard Ricochet that I, I feel like I just finally, like, saw the picture, and I was like, damn, this dude is very versatile, very talented. And what I'm picking up, and Ricochet really showed it, and now I'm really getting it from this song especially, is I love it when he does that, like, just boom! Like, he just goes for it, and he has this, like, kind of, like, th throaty vocal delivery. It's kind of near, like, a baritone, and it's just so forceful and passionate, and it's just, there's so much richness to it. And I love his falsetto. I really love his use of falsetto or head voice or whatever you'd call that. But I find that his chorus is very dynamic. That's one thing about Star Set is their choruses are dynamic. Um, he's always kind of going in and out of um, different feelings and vibes within the same chorus. Like he'll, he'll go really sensitive and then go powerful. And, like, all in, in a single chorus. Like, he'll just kind of ch change things. And I've noticed in these four songs, he has an incredible ear for melody. This guy, like, all the choruses stick in your head, which is, um, that's how you make it big. <laughs> and these guys are popular. So, honestly, that's what you do. You just, like, a lot of melody and a lot of passion, man. That's, like, their their thing. And, fuck, man, I, I, I'm loving these guys. They're blowing me away every time now. Just I'm, I feel like I'm just liking them more and more with every song. I just the videos are just so high tech and always thought provoking. And they they seem to have a thing with like um military government surveillance, kind of V for Vendetta. If you haven't seen V for Vendetta, masterpiece of a movie. And the comic book is incredible. I like the comic book even more, but that's because I'm an Alan Moore fanboy. 
But um, definitely check out that move. Just chills, and you'll know why. I am everything I am. Myself below. I'll be what you want it kept inside. I won't let go till I burn beyond control. Who are you to change this world? Steady boy, no one needs to hear your words. Let it go. I love how layered their music is. That that's one thing. I love all the layers, man. And yeah, these guys are <laughs> they're good songwriters. Like every song I've I've listened to them like has a verse, a pre-chorus, a chorus. Like it seems like they have like po like their bridges are fully fleshed out. They have like really good intros to all the songs. I find just their star set. One thing that comes to me now. When I think of this band, is attention to detail. Every song I've heard has meticulous attention to detail, and that that like I said, that it goes into the vocal delivery. Um, it never feels like they're just going through the motions. Or like I always say this, I find most verses in music, like just in music, is quite simple. Um, the verses never stand out. Um, they're just a storytelling mechanism a lot of time, or a lyrical mechanism. Where I've noticed with um, Star Set is I, I always enjoy the verses. Like, obviously, the chorus is cathartic. It's the big crescendo. It's the emotional masterpiece that ties everything together. It's the glue that holds the song together. But I just, I, I still, like, <laughs> like, I'm never bored. Like, I'm never, like, okay, onto the chorus. Like, I, I feel like the verses always drive in, into the chorus rather than, like, okay, let's just wait for the chorus. Which is, like, a lot of songs, that's what it is for me, is... I'll just be kind of like waiting for the chorus where this song, everything is always moving up and I'm never waiting. I'm always kind of taken with the ocean in a way, taken with the waves and just kind of brought with the momentum. It feels like, again, like the song is a whole entity rather than a selection of individualized parts. Again, great songwriters. Um, it's not easy to do that. It's not easy to make a song coherent yet unique and layered, right? A lot of the time, if you want to make a song feel coherent, you have to essentially take the, the ebbs and the flows and try to lower them to, to a coherence rate. But with their stuff is, again, I think their trick is rather than have two separate parts, like the verse and the chorus, they almost like bridge them really well. Like I said, the ver the verses kind of have this like rising tension, which rather than just makes it feel like a verse, it, it feels like it's something, it doesn't feel like the song has like parts as much. It feels like it just flows. But I've said that like three times in different ways, but all in all, great song, love and star set. Um, definitely, yeah, you guys do too. Definitely star set's one of the stronger um, communities on the channel for sure.
Um, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this. If you enjoyed the video and you want to support the channel, definitely best way to do so is um like other like best way to do so that's free is just subscribe, like the videos, again it helps with the algorithm and share them around and yeah, subscribe and just join the family. Honestly, it's incredibly helpful. So thanks again for all your love and support and I'll see you again tomorrow. All right, I love you guys, peace.